This right behind me is one of the most expensive houses in Emirates Hills in Dubai. Wow, yeah. this is something. What is that safe doing in the middle of the living room? This house has six bedrooms. Every room yeah. has a special theme. Wow. We have a spa, we have a gym, we have sauna, we have a steam room, we have an entertainment lounge and a basement with one of the craziest cinemas I've ever seen. I mean, this is literally like how you're entering into the Oscars. Yeah. Watching a movie like this is an experience in itself. And by the way, fun fact, this house has used the most amount of real gold ever used to build a house. Four and a half kgs worth of gold gone into this art installation. Yeah. Your sink has gold in it as well. Yeah. Wow. So guys, before we get to the rest of the tour, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and enjoy the rest of the tour. Guys, you're finally inside this crazy mansion. And before we get started the tour, let me introduce you guys to Artur, Artur from Espas. Artur, thank you so much for you're allowing welcome. us access into this crazy house. So Artur is the exclusive listing agent of this property. And Artur, tell us a little bit more about this house. First of all, welcome again to Thanks. probably most expensive and unique house in Emirates Hills at the moment. This is a 32,000 built up area on set on 18,000 plots. Massive ground floor, first floor with the six bedrooms, all on suite, beautifully laid. And to start the tour, we will move from here to the family living area. Wow, yeah. this is something. Oh, it really gives you the feel of the grandness of this house when you come over here. Chandler been uh, custom built particular for this living room. Wow, very, Everything very nice. been exported from Italy. All features that you see in the living room been exported from Italy. And this Custom is all built. Roberto Cavalli, right? All Roberto Cavalli, correct. Wow. It took us more than eight months to receive this product. Wow. So everything was ready just to install it by. It took us uh, almost three years to finish this. Really? Because 98% of items in this house, from furniture to chandeliers to the wooden panels on the walls being exported from France, Italy and Spain. Because of Corona, it took a little bit longer, but at the end of the day, we received it and I mean, we I love just that. finished the house, yeah. Wow. I love this art yeah. installation on the wall of that gold. It's I had the liberty of doing a little bit of private tour with Artur before we started the video. And he actually gave me a very interesting piece of information that there's four kgs of gold gone. Four and a half kg of gold being used for this kitchen, wow. for the lava, for the Guys, wall. Guys, four and a half kgs worth of gold gone into this art installation. Wow. And you can see the lava over there as well, coming around the elevator. Wow. It's a natural gold plated feature. Wow. So nothing fake. I mean, I so expensive, I'm not even sure if I can touch it, you know. I mean, this is something I'll give itself. you one of the finger when you do <laughs> Please. <laughs> so whoever's buying this house, I'm going to be taking one finger away from that art installation. Please, let me tell you that. And one thing I want to ask you, by the way, Artur, what is that safe doing in the middle of the living room? Well, that was actually the safe being built for the owner of the house, but when we brought it here, yeah. it was so nicely fitting into the living room concept, so yeah. we decided to keep it here. Wow, that we looks really cool, it, by the way. Yeah, but it was for the master bedroom. Oh, okay. Yeah, but we decided to keep it here because it looks so nice. I mean, this is yeah. a piece That's of a, art in itself. Yes, it is a piece of art. It's, it's a fine. real safe. Wow. It's real safe. You can oh, keep it has them. those yeah. classical turning knobs yeah. and wow. Yeah. Any billionaire buying this house yeah. will have enough watches and enough uh, things to put inside. Oh, probably enough gold to yeah. put inside the safe. Love the woodwork that they've done inside the living room as well. I mean, this is something yeah. in itself. All the wooden panels being yeah. exported from Italy. Some people using it for the boats, for the yachts. Yeah, so this too. is the boat yeah. wood. Okay. This is a boat wood. 
It's matching to Dubai lifestyle and to Dubai weather. Okay. It's very difficult to find a real nice wood which will last long. You, okay. You've probably seen a lot of villas which, yeah, of course. in five, six years, you will see it stop killing, it stop, you know. This so is we use to last. Yes, this is 100 years warranty. <laughs> <laughs> Love the electronic the automatic bar counter yeah. that comes a up. Small elevator on the bar, yeah. So it has a feature to go down. Ooh, that's pretty cool, guys. Check that out. Yeah. That is a nice little party trick, you know, <laughs> for the bartender. So you to don't do. you don't really need any bar here. That's it. So wow. It's very plain, beautiful yellow onyx. Beautifully done. Yeah, I mean, the level done. of workmanship that has gone over here and the kind of quality that the owner has used is really something in itself. Yeah. Wow, I love the kind of marble slabs that they've yeah. used over here as well. Like One of the largest we've done. Defined. Yeah. Perfectly, very nicely done joints. And let's move to the kitchen. So we've got here a kitchen slash breakfast area, fully fitted with the Gaganao appliances. Yeah, a lot of I mean, I wouldn't trips. expect anything less yeah. in, a villa, in a villa of this. Possible. So we got a chef kitchen here as well. Wow. With a proper industrial proper, style. Proper industrial style. We could be hosting. A lot of guests. A lot of here. guests. You can bring uh, Ramsey here and <laughs> throw the party. I think he will be happy. Done. Having, having a kitchen like that. <laughs> well, I'm sure if you're buying this house, you can afford Gordon Ramsay to yeah, come down to your easy, house. Easy, easy. <laughs> and cook you a nice little iftar or suhoor yeah, since yeah. it's Ramadan right now. Exactly. So Farouk, let's continue with the formal living area. Okay. And dining area. So it's one of the largest room in the house. So. We've got here a massive wow. a dining area. Wow, that's a massive dining table. Yeah, massive dining table, nice cozy sitting area. Wow. You have a wine coolers here. Wow, and nice. a good feature, if you don't want your guests to go through the main living room, you have a separate entrance oh, a separate for entrance. them okay. to enter the house right from the, outside. Yeah, or the dining area. Okay. So they can come direct to the very nice. Yeah. To the formal living. I love this elephant yeah. art feature on the wall. Beautiful done. How many seater dining table is this? One, two, three, four, five, five, ten, twelve sitter. This is in itself, I mean this boat wood dining table in itself is something like an art piece in itself. Yeah, custom built in Italy as well. Beautiful but, chandelier. Yeah, beautiful Very nicely chandelier. done. I love the wine cellar as well. Uh, it's really a display of your collection, Correct. <laughs> if anything. Correct. I love the way these guys done the TVs, yeah. you know, they're huge. Uh, and you we see they, this throughout yeah, the house as well. You don't want to see any wires, you don't want to see anything like that. So yeah. Very nicely nice done, very, yeah. very, very nicely done. So now I would like to show you the study area. Okay. Uh, which is a small office wow. for the future owner, yeah. This is a pretty cool office. Yes. Guys, this is what a billionaire's office looks like. So we've got boatwood on the wall, a very, very grand brown sort of sitting table. I mean, just imagine someone sitting over here. I mean, I think you'd look of natural crocodile leather. Wow. However, you can easily convert it into a ground bedroom if you need. Yeah. Easy, because we it's en suite. Okay, it has a wardrobe and it has the bathroom. This can be easy converted into a ground floor bedroom just in case you've got an elder parent living with you or visiting you very often. Let me show you the very private meeting room, which probably uh, people will love wow, to have. Wow, there's a fireplace! Oh, that's pretty cool! Exactly. Wow. We have, fireplace, we have a small samurai. Wow. And then we yeah. have a world map. A world map. Right exactly. over here. And we have a nice TV right across from the dining table. I mean, guys, this is, imagine your billionaire client sitting over here, watching world news, having a nice little fireplace at the back. I mean, it's just very nice and very cozy. And again, uh, and this is real fire, right? Oh yeah, it is real fire. It's good yes. <laughs> I just had to check that. <laughs> it is real fire, yeah. And very, again, very nice. it's en suite as well. So okay. it can be easy turned into a bedroom just if the owner wants more bedrooms on the ground floor. Very nice. We decided to turn it into a very private, like, dining area. Yeah. Very it's cool. for people who works from home, who gets his partners into the house most yeah. of the time. You have a nice little exactly. dinner meeting over here with yeah. your clients. Close Play private, door. close doors. Now, Farouk, since we've seen the downstairs, downstairs area, yeah, yeah. let's go upstairs and see the bedrooms. I'm excited. Yeah. Let's yeah. do this. Where's the Benji?
They picking sides, they crossing the line. I stick to the truth, I'm one of a kind. Gave it a god and follow his signs. Now all of a sudden I'm stuck in my prime. I'm wishing them well, I threw him a dime. They stuck in the shell, they drowning with time. I love the skylight over here. Yeah, this very is nice. they, they, they made it. Of... Yeah, they made it looks very natural. We actually have the gloss on top of it. Okay. But since it's very difficult to maintain clean all the time, yeah. so they come up with the idea just to put the natural light, just close it and put the, you know, this soft bulb. They mix uh, up the light, you will, you will feel that it's natural, but it's actually a proper electrical light behind the ceiling. Wow, very nice. And I love the lava, lava. that's falling down yeah. on the elevator. This is uh, well, yeah, an art piece in itself. Lots of gold users in the house. Yeah. But very tastefully done. done. I think it's very yeah, specific, not, but very tastefully not done. Not overloaded, you know, yeah. not overloaded. Before we start looking at the bedrooms, let me explain to you upper floor. Okay. So we've got two uh, family rooms here. Okay. Um, very straight layout. Okay. Six bedrooms. Three on the one side, three on another side. All right. That's it. A very simple, very straightforward layout. No okay. complication, no curves, no nothing. And every room yeah. has a special theme. Okay. So let's start from the Egyptian room. All right, let's start. <laughs> wow. This is something. Everything you're seeing in this bedroom yeah. is being made in Europe, handmade, customized for this particular bedroom. Wow. I mean, okay. this is... This is yeah. very cool. I mean, I love the ceiling. Ceiling, yeah. especially this. Yeah. This looks like it's painted on papyrus. Yes, yes, wow. it is. It is. Wow, it this is. is something. And then, of course, we've got the Hermes. Yes, everything. everywhere Hermes, and then we have the Versace lamp. I mean, this is an art piece in itself, guys. I mean, yeah. where have you guys seen a bedroom that looks like this? I mean, everything from the columns. Check out this column. Black, gold. Work on the wall, work on this side. I mean, there's something which is You're right. custom built for every inch of this room. And if you move towards the bathroom. Wow. Check that out. Since it's an Egyptian bedroom, we decided to use a little bit of storm, sand kind of awning fillings. Wow, and I love the, the backsplash in the shower room as well. Yeah, the largest, the largest shower room we could find. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is a pretty big yeah. shower head. I mean, this screams out quality. I mean, just look at the kind of work that they've done over here. And then this is gold as well, right? Yeah, we call it gold leaf. Wow. It's very thin metal. Okay. Being installed under the plastic or glass. I don't know how they call it, but wow. this is pure gold just under it. Your sink has gold in it as well. Yeah. Wow. You wash your face looking in the gold. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Yeah. All right, guys, let's go check out the next bedroom. Yeah. So, Farouk, we're going to a second bedroom. Okay. Um, the team here is Asian. We, we used a particular uh, a Japanese team. I mean, you feel like you're in a completely different house. I mean, yeah. They've just transformed. Yes. Wow, into man. something different. Wow, so soft dope, silk yes. cloth used. Correct. Wow. This is glass. Really? Yeah, this, this is glass. This is painted. Yes. Wow. I mean, I just love how they've got a completely different theme over here. He loves the samurai, huh? We yeah. saw that samurai in the dining area as yeah. well. And then yeah. we see another one over here. And then this had he some this had a story art. behind it as well, right? Yeah, this is actually a, a one, a full bone of the elephant. I'm not sure if Greenpeace people will like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a handmade from the full bone. It's nothing, it's not glued. It's like being drafted actually wow. by one very famous artist. And even the sofa itself has a very Japanese theme going. So over here we have the bathroom which is matching a Japanese theme. Okay. As you can see, we have matched the onyx. And Farouk, tell me what you see here. Since I already know this, I cheated. <laughs> so you see the top part over there is the marble. They had to find two pieces of marble that looked like a geisha, right? Exactly, yeah. And then in the bottom part, they found two pieces of marble that looked like a panda. Exactly. To give it that Japanese touch. I mean, that's what I've been told by the artist, and that is <laughs> mind-blowing, guys. Finding a piece of marble that actually matches the theme of your bedroom, I mean, that's pretty cool, Arthur. And I love how they've changed the entire cabinets over here to match the theme of the bedroom as well. Correct. 
Let's move to a third bedroom. So this is a second family lounge over here. Yeah, this is a larger one. Yeah. Uh, and it has a small pantry upstairs. Okay. Just for a quick coffee. Ah, oh, nice. Uh, some drink, soft drinks and etc. It has a refrigerator as well. Oh, so great. if you want something cooler. Yeah. Well, wow, this is like a solid metallic. Correct, yeah. So we try to match yeah, everything. Cover it up. And I love the chandeliers yeah. that are being used in the little bar area. <laughs> yeah. And guys, I mean, they know no other brand other than Versace. Hermes. And we've got, oh, we've got Hermes right over here. I mean, they have not spared money when it comes to any detail in this house. All right. So we will move on to an Arabic room. Yeah, there's a theme changing in every bedroom in this house. That's pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. This looks like a Sultan's bedroom. Like Correct. literally. Correct. Wow. This is one of my favorite bedrooms because it's very bright. It's a good size. It's a very Dubai style since I love being in Dubai. I like these <laughs> concepts. I mean, they know no other brand other than Hermes and Versace and Cavalli. Exactly. No Zara home. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Wow. I mean, no, you won't find out. it in the market so easy. It's a blue onyx, which took us four and a half months to receive it. And I love how it's all backlit as well. It's very nicely done. And a much bigger shower room over here. Oh, and then we have the gigantic rain head again. Yeah. Then we move to a very simple bedroom, I can say, without any... Wow. This is simple? This is... This, this is simple this is for the, the standards of this house. Yeah, <laughs> this is the most simple bedroom. They wow. call it Deco. They have okay. decided to make this bedroom very natural without any theme. Very Italian style. Very, very nice. Yeah. Now let's move on to the master bedroom. We will... We will That's for the last. Yes. We will skip this bedroom and you will understand why. Okay. By the way, each of these small tables yeah. worth 4,000 euros. 4,000 euros? 4,000 euros, each of them. Each? Sorry, I don't want to... 4,000, 4,000, 4,000, 4,000? I don't want to name the brand, yeah. but when it comes to wow, you, guys. I'll put all brands on the table. <laughs> yeah. 4,000 wow, euros cool. every table. Wow. Ooh, the master. Master bed. Wow. Oh, I love how it's clad in leather in the ceiling as well. Exactly, correct. And then you have this tiger. Tiger mosaic, handmade mosaic. Wow. This is a lot of detailing gone into this. I mean, guys, look at this. this boat wood on the wall, mosaic over here. Wow. By the way, guys, there's so much detailing gone into this house that we actually forgot this house is on the lake! Let's <laughs> check out the view of this house. Wow. There you go. This is a beautiful lake view. And you know, there's something peaceful about being on the lake. You know, when you just come out, it's just therapeutic in itself. Jeez. Beautiful. You hear the bird, you hear the lake, Very you nice. hear the wind. Beautiful. Varu, regarding the skip room. Okay. So, massive walking closet. Okay. Ah, Beautiful. Huge. They call it wow. Volcano Onyx. Wow. Guys, this is something else. This is what I call a master bathroom. Beautiful jacuzzi right in the center. Very, very nice Onyx work on the wall. This is what, how royalty showers. <laughs> this is literally. All right. Massive closet. Oh, it extends all the way down here. All oh, wow. the way down there. My wife would love this. Yeah. <laughs> That's for sure. And it connects the bedroom, which ah, we have skipped. Okay. Because, yeah. Right, nice. So this would be like your kid's bedroom kids or something. Kid's bedroom, if you have a nanny, okay. if you have a security. Oh, this anything. is a really nice bedroom for a nanny. Also ensuite. Yeah, ensuite yeah, it's with it's the, en suite. So we've got an attached bathroom over here as well. And you have the jacuzzi and then the backlit onyx over here as well. And I love how the sink has lights inside. I mean, this is... Very, very cool. And then you have the gold plated inside, inside the sink. I mean, lots of attention to detail has gone inside this house. Guys. Correct. So guys, now that you guys have seen the downstairs of the house, we've seen all the six bedrooms upstairs. Now we're gonna go check out 
my favorite part of this house, which luckily I had the liberty to check out before we started this tour with Artur, it is the basement. Guys, this is one of the craziest basements I've ever seen in my life. So first, I'm gonna show you guys the basement, and then we'll take you guys to the outside of the house to check out the pool and the outdoor area. So guys, keep watching, and like every time, guys, don't forget to like this video before we get to the basement, and subscribe to this channel. Let me take you guys downstairs. Your favorite part of the house. <laughs> Guys, I love this. I mean, this has to be one of the craziest basements I've ever seen in my life. By the way, this entire side of the basement, by the way, this is only one half of the basement. The other half of the basement is a party area, an entertainment area, and the parking. Six car garage that we have, which is all underground. And this is the other entertainment side. So we have one entertainment side where you have the bar and you have a sort of party lounge yeah. area that you could play around with. And guys, check this out. Look at the attention to detail over here. Like they put the ticketing counter over here as well. Very, very nice. I mean, this is literally like how you're entering into the Oscars, yeah, literally. I mean, exactly. beautiful. You could add all your memorabilia over here. Lots of nice cabinets over here that you could actually put like... I mean, you could sell this house to a Hollywood star and you could put his Oscars over here. That's what we're targeting. We're targeting Hollywood star. <laughs> or Bollywood star. <laughs> or Bollywood star, exactly. exactly. Oh, and then we have a 007 poster over here. Yeah. Welcome to our cinema. Wow, I mean... Exactly. This has to be one of the coolest cinema rooms I've ever, ever seen. Oh, these are nice loungers. Exactly. You can heat or you can cool your drink. Wow! Guys, check this out. Wow. Watching a movie like this is an experience in itself. And then you have the bigger loungers down over there. Guys, check this out. I mean, this is really, really cool. I mean, you have these beds over here that you could literally sleep and watch your movies. Very, very nicely done. I mean, and then you have a little bar over there or a popcorn counter. All right. Then we've got a... <laughs> That's pretty cool. How to Marry a Millionaire, guys. Very important movie to <laughs> watch. watch this. So, a gym is ready, but we're still waiting for the equipment to be delivered. Okay. So... Oh, very nice big yeah. space. Decent size gym, yeah. decent size. So we've got a few equipments coming in this week. Okay. So, Villa will be 100% ready, literally in uh, three to four weeks maximum. Okay. So it will be ready to hand over to the Owner. And my favorite part of the house is the spa. So sauna is again not 100% completed, still ongoing, some bits here and there, wow. but you can... I mean, this is yeah, really, really you nice. You can enjoy. This is a jacuzzi. This is a jacuzzi, we are testing it now. Wow, very nice. Yeah. I love the marble staircase. Exactly, natural marble. Wow. Very black cool. marble, white natural marble. And then very we've nice. got sauna. We've got a smaller jacuzzi over there. If you, wow. don't wanna, if you don't wanna go too far for a bigger one. <laughs> <laughs> then shower and the steam room. I mean, this is probably the highest end spa you could find in a house. I mean, this is, this is something. Oh, check this out. One of the nicest saunas I've seen, I must say. So guys, now that you guys have seen the basement of this house, I mean, what do you guys think? Come on, let me know in the comments what you guys think about this basement. Personally, for me, this has been one of the craziest basements I've ever, ever seen. I'm a huge movie lover. I love kicking back and relaxing on the weekend, watching a nice little movie with my wife. So I would love to have a cinema room look like this. Anyways, guys, now that we've seen the upstairs of the house, we've seen the basement, now it's finally time to take you guys outside and show you the outdoor space. So guys, you're finally in my favorite part of the house, which is the outdoor, and we have a beautiful garden in this house. By the way, tell us a little more about the garden. Yeah. So we've got a lot of outdoor system hidden behind these bushes. Okay. So we can really throw a nice party here. We have a custom built uh, shower. Oh, that's what this is? Yes. I thought this, this was an art installation. No, no. <laughs> it looks like an art, but it's a custom built shower. It's probably the only one in Dubai. Wow. Then we've got a custom built pergola with a built-in sound system and uh, night star kind of fillings. Wow. All lightnings, cool. yeah, it's beautiful. A lot of firework, fire pits, I mean, it's beautiful. So 
guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed the tour of this beautiful ultra luxury mansion over here in Emirates Hills. If you guys would like a private guided tour, make sure to contact us on the number below and let us know in the comment section about what you guys think about this house as well. And guys, like every time, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and till I see you guys again for another great vlog.